Good. Okay, great. Cisco, the last three games you scored no goals, and then today you scored three. How how happy are you with with that improvement? No, uh, I think uh, we spoke about this before the game. Uh, we spoke about uh, we need uh, we are the, uh, solid in uh, in defense and more aggressive in uh, in offense. I think uh, today was a very good performance. The team uh, was uh, more time, long time in uh, in good uh, in good level, and uh, I think uh, we, we was always the the control the the game. And for your team to to concede, obviously you went ahead and conceded. How pleased were you with the way they stayed calm and and still found two more goals afterwards? Hemos conseguido un gol en la manera que hemos conseguido, pero cuando estás contento y si estás tranquilo después, al final hemos conseguido nada. Hemos recibido. Que no hemos conseguido más de un. No, it's uh, we know we know about the game, but all, all, always we was the control of the game. I think uh, we had the ball. We have uh, also uh, a lot of change, a lot of chance for for a score. It's. Uh, also in the 45, Sar have one against one also with the goalkeeper, the second half. It's uh, the normally is the situation. No, it's uh, for me, it's uh, I told you, it's a uh, mature performance. I think uh, the team was in good level, but we need to continue to work very hard because I know what is the, the level of the Premier League. You mentioned Sar there just. How good was he today? Yeah, Sar was very well, but not only Sar. I think that the team was, I told you before, about the, was mature, was uh, more time. We spoke in the in the last time in our press conference about the long time and uh, and uh, mature different things with ball, without ball, the timing of the game. And I think the, the team today was, was the control about the game and uh, is perfect because he's a uh, one step forward. How how big is it for you to, to get that first away win of the season? Uh, all the points this season is very important away at home. And uh, it's important what we spoke before about uh, now today we are happy because uh, we take the three points, but the most important always stay everyone together and work very hard about about all the points. I think it uh, was very good performance. We need to work the next week very hard for try the Stock City and after the Newcastle, I'll give another very good performance uh, at home. Perfect. Thank you. Thank you. Cisco, hello. It's, it's Adam. Yeah. yeah, we can hear you. Yeah. I just wanted to ask you about some of the... So, Okay, some of the changes that you made um, in midfield, you seem to have a, a, a good balance at the back and then being able to go forward. Tom Cleverly coming in, he, had, he added real energy to the, to the midfield. You must have been happy with the, with the blend in midfield. Una pregunta sobre la situación de centrocampo. Parece muy compacto, parece muy compacto, con un buen nivel de balance. Y tiene que estar muy contento con uh, el resultado de tu decisión. Yeah, today... Today uh, we have uh, uh, something uh, 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 change in the in the first eleven. We try to give the the experienced players about the situation, and uh, I think uh, was very well. And uh, but I repeat, it is important. Uh, was a very good performance, but we need humility. Humility. We need to work very hard, and we need uh, keep going about this. Was a very good performance. Was a complete performance but uh when the, uh, before today we spoke about the process i think in the same and we need to always uh keep going keep going we're going and take the ball very hard for for the next game can you explain the the decision behind repeating daniel backman with ben foster was there any um physical problem for backman was there a little bit of a doubt over his fitness? So this gave you an opportunity to bring in Foster? No, no, no. It's uh, uh, everybody know I have very good three goalkeepers. 
Foster, Danny, and Rob. But uh, sometimes uh, I need to take one decision. But uh, not only about him, also with Cathar, we can explain about the the change we have today. We had today because uh, I try to give the this experience, you no, know, this uh, mature situations, and uh, was well. I think uh, was very well because they play very well. And uh, also, always I spoke about we have uh, 23, 24 players in very good level, and uh, we can use. And I think uh, we, today was a very good ele ele election about them, and we give a very good performance for our team. And what's the situation with uh, Kika Femenia? Because obviously, when he was when he played, he really added something to the right hand side. But he went off injured. Is it a is it a serious injury? Is it no, a repeat uh, of his previous injury? No, 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 no. About uh, about Kiko, we know what is the the trainings he had, and uh, I know how many minutes he can uh, play. It's only it's a uh, it's a little uh, rampas, tired, a little tired, the muscles and which. Okay. Cheers, Adam. Thank you. Mark. Hi, I was just wanting very quickly, Ismail Assar has obviously attracted a lot of attention from many clubs. Are you surprised that Watford have been able to keep hold of a player of his quality? There's obviously so many big clubs have been looking at him. Pregunta sobre Ismail Assar, que ya, ya se sabe que hay muchos más grandes que están interesados en él. Estaba un poco sorprendido que hemos podido um, conseguir que se quedara aquí. Uh, I can speak only about Sar. I feel him is very happy here and uh, he enjoy every day in the trainings and he give very good things for, for our team. Thank you. Anyone else, guys? Doesn't look like it. Okay. All the best to you. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Bye. Bye.